And if you want to create your own NFT marketplace, the way we have built that, if you want to include this multi-chain functionality, you can use this SDK. This, if you're a blockchain developer, then I believe you would love this framework. It's called Ta2. The name is quite weird, but recently they have raised close to 41.5 million in their first round of funding. And the best part about this framework is that it's totally dedicated to the Web3 developer. So you can build your dApp faster and even more flexible way. So in this video, I'll give you a complete walkthrough about this framework that in which scenario you can include this framework in your dApp. What are the features we have if you want to use this as a framework in your Web3 development? That's all we're going to talk about in this week. So this is how the interface would look like. Let me scroll down. You can find that where they got highlighted features. So all the information is there, but we are interested in the feature of this framework. And the one thing I really like about this framework is this. So they provide a bunch of things. They will provide you the SDK, the key management, the API endpoints, the CLI. But my favorite is this one. So generally what happened when you want to build any application, just imagine that you are building an application in Web2 space and you need to have certain functionality. So in that scenario, you have multiple packages. So if you want to have a validation, email validation functionality, you can easily able to install one of the packages and you will have that features in the application. So there is a tons of packages are available for the Web3 space. But in case of Web3, we don't have that many popular packages. We have only three popular packages like Ether.js, Web3 model and Web3.js. So these are the three packages we have, which we have to utilize to communicate with the blockchains. But the best part about this framework SDK is that it comes with a 60 plus blockchain protocol. So in case if you want to communicate with the Ethereum and that scenario, we have to write a lot of code for only communicating with the Ethereum. If you want to communicate with the Polygon, Solana or any other blockchain, you have to write separate custom code for that. But if you use this framework, it will come with a SDK. So all you have to do is to call that SDK for that particular blockchain and you will have all the features. You can easily able to fetch the price. You can easily able to make the transaction. You can easily able to get the RPC URL. So every single thing that would be provided to you in this feature, in this framework, so you don't need to write a lot of code. And that's why they have mentioned that you can easily able to build your application faster and even in more flexible way. So if you want to mint NFT, you have multiple options. You can provide multiple options to your clients to mint an NFT to the Ethereum, Polygon, Solana. You can integrate multiple wallets. So that's a powerful thing I found about this framework. And that's why I'm making this video about this SDK. It's really amazing. They also have a key management system which you can utilize to manage all the different wallets you have. Here you will have the RPC URL as a REST API. So if you want to fetch information about the NFTs or any transaction on any particular blockchain, so you can easily able to do that. So here they have mentioned that right now they're offering 60 plus blockchains, which from where you can easily able to fetch the information about the transaction. So they also have their CLI, but I really, I haven't explored this. So I'll just keep it for a side. There is tons of things you can come and you can explore everything from so if i scroll they also offer this plan so in the free version you can easily able to make five calls per second and they have a couple of restrictions but if you are learning then definitely i would tell you that go with this one and if you really want to launch your own product then you can pick any one of these plans depends on your budget and the kind of application you want to build so what i want i want to get click on this get started okay so just click on this get started i have already created my account dashboard. so once you create your account this is the dashboard you will get and here you will find all the information about this tattoo framework so right now i'm on the api section so if i want to make any api request for that i need a key from here i can select the network that which network i want to connect which which blockchain i want to choose so you can easily able to check from here you can easily able to see that how many requests you are making what is the credit the best part about this framework is that you don't need to go anywhere else to learn about this framework they have inbuilt tutorial close to 60 plus tutorials they have on this dashboard you will find and you can easily able to read and understand that how you have to make the api call so if you want to use this they have a step-by-step -step tutorials if you want to fetch the nft about that you have if you want to mint the nft they also have that so if you want to mint nft on any particular blockchains so you don't need to go and create your application or you have to go to any particular marketplace to do that you can do it right from this dashboard this is the api documentation so you can explore this one this is the feature documentation so if you want to connect multiple wallets this is the one and this is the article section here you will find all the articles about this 
okay so if i come here this is the best part i like about this tattoo framework so if you click on this M nft mentor you will get this dashboard and from here you can easily be able to select whatever blockchains you want to mint your nft so all you have to do is to drag and drop your nft you have to give the titles you have to provide your api key you have to fill out all the details and all you have to do is to simply call this function it's that simple okay so must come and explore this one this one is really amazing and very powerful and if you want to create your own nft marketplace the way we have built that if you want to include this multi-chain functionality you can use this sdk this framework to build and have the same functionality to deploy the deploy the nft to the multiple blockchain okay so all the blockchains these are the popular blockchain you will find in which you can easily able to deploy your contract or deploy your nft okay if you come here here you will find the deposit this is the information i don't know what it is so maybe you will get all the details about the api calls this is the subscription sections this is the webhook and this is a virtual account there is a tons of thing so it's not possible to cover every single thing about this framework because this framework is really very vast and the kind of feature it's provide in the sdk it's also incredibly amazing so if i come click on the api section and if i click on this api documentations here you will find everything that how you have to utilize it okay so if you guys really want i can make a project using this framework and that i will show you that how you can utilize the sdk to communicate with the different blockchain so here you can able to find everything okay so here we'll find the list of all the blockchains are there so we have node rpc bitcoin bitcoin crash so there's tons of things you can come and you can explore so all you have to do is to check how you can utilize that if you click on this dogecoin here you will find all the information so you will get the api endpoints so you can see all the calls you can easily able to get okay how you can easily able to fetch the data how you can able to make the transaction what are the options they are providing you in terms of transaction i believe that you found this video helpful if you still have any confusion any doubt do let me know in the comment section and if you guys really want me to build a complete tutorial using this framework so do let me know that in the comment section so i will try to make a tutorial still any confusion end out do let me know in the comment section and if you're new to my channel hit like and subscribe that will motivate me a lot and that's the only thing i want to say so with that i'm ending this video have a wonderful day bye, -bye.